It's time for your favorite weekly mathematics quiz competition, Cowbellpedia. Cowbellpedia, it's all about math wits. Welcome to the 2016 Cowbellpedia mathematics competition for secondary school students across Nigeria. We've had artists, singers, chefs, musicians, our students have displayed other sides of them over the last couple of weeks that shows that they're not only good in maths, but other areas. But these are also some of the qualities of a true inventor. And we at Cowbell Peter believe that each and every student and everyone out there has the potential to be the next inventor. Undoubtedly, the number one mathematics quiz competition for secondary school students in Nigeria and Africa, we're proud of all our candidates who have made it this far. From over 47,000 students, the best 108 have made it to phase two of the competition, which is Cowbellpedia. We have nine prelims, three semifinals, and one grand final that will produce the undisputed mathematical champion in the junior and senior category. This is the seventh prelim, which means 12 students have made it to the semifinal from the junior and senior category. We have 12 more on standby and only four spots are available for them in the semi-final. It's been an interesting journey so far, very entertaining, and probably some new records have been set on the show. And talking about records, congratulations to those of you at home who have participated in our home plate question from last week. I am Oscar, your quiz master, and we at Promasador, yes, we, I'm, I'm part of them, the makers of Cowbell Our Milk, brought to you this fantastic show and is also endorsed by Neko. We'll be back after the break to give you the home play question for this week, introduce you to the rules, and meet the first six contestants in the junior category who are taking the next step towards becoming the undisputed mathematical champion 2016. Instantly dissolving cowbell milk is both delicious and nutritious. It promotes good health and vitality. Cowbell milk has a blend of the important vitamins which we call Vita-Rich. A, C, D, E and K. Plus vitamin B9, which helps with brain development. We've also got a deliciously creamy new formula that dissolves instantly. Cowbell, now deliciously creamy. Welcome back. Now we've got a couple of comments, not a couple, a lot of comments, tweets, messages about all of you out there who have participated in our home play and you're wondering, am I on the scoreboard, am I not? Well, there are two things happening. First of all, if you want to practice your questions, you can visit cowboypedia.ng and click on that button that takes you to the practice questions. But if you want to be on the scoreboard, you need to download the Cowboypedia app from the Google Play Store on all Android devices and start practicing as many questions as possible. Our scoreboard is updated every week with the highest scores for the week, and if your name is there, you might find yourself on this side, answering questions from this set and winning fantastic prizes. Now, talking about prizes, one million Naira is at stake for our champions in the junior and senior categories, respectively. 400,000 Naira also for the teachers. An educational excursion out of the country and the bragging rights for the year 2016. It's been quite interesting, entertaining, but most importantly, it's serious business for our young math gurus. We have six of them ready and on standby. Let's meet our six contestants after the break. For decades, mathematics has been the bedrock of the world's greatest innovations. We believe that we too 
can set indelible footprints in the sands of technology. If we invest in our children and in their future, knowing fully well that from amongst them can come the next best innovators. Tomorrow's Einstein, Maria Mayers, Ayodele Awujobi, Philip Emeagwani. Yes, we have a dream that our children can be great. Since 2001, Cowbell has been on the front line promoting mathematics as a means to empowering young people and nourishing their dreams, harnessing their potential, irrespective of their background or ethnicity. Yes, we believe in our children, in their greatness, in what they can be. Reach for the stars with Nourishing Cowbell. Cowbell. To the students out there who want to be part of the Cowboypedia show, before the next season, you have the opportunity to be part of the Cowboypedia radio show, which airs on select radio stations across the country. Visit cowboypedia.ng to find out the station and the time it's airing in your state. It airs between 6.15 and 7.30 a.m. across all these stations. Here's our home play question for this week. I wish you all the best. Which of the following is a plain shape? A. Sphere. B. Cylinder, C. Cuboid, and D. Circle. Be part of the Cowbellpedia Best 11. Type SC, space, your name, space, location, space, your answer, to 33121 for a chance to win fabulous prizes for the week. Make sure you send in the correct answers, and judging by the answers and the responses we've been getting, I have a feeling that we have quite an impressive number of inventors out there. And talking about inventors, we have six young candidates here in the junior category who are ready to take the next step towards that ultimate crown. But do they have what it takes to move them beyond this round? We have two rounds, round one, which is objective questions. We have 12 of them. At the end of round one, the three students with the most correct answers and the highest scores will move on to round two, which is our 60 seconds of fame. We like to call it the Cowbellpedia 60 seconds of fame. You're given 60 seconds to give as many correct answers in 60 seconds as possible. At the end of round one and round two, the two students with the highest scores will move on to the semi-final. This is the seventh prelim, which means 12 students are already in the semi-final. Let's take the next couple of minutes to know more about the hobbies and where our contestants are from. My name is Labuchi Collins Shukuma from Dorit International Secondary School, Abayaba, Abia State. Collins, great to have you. I always love to know as much as I can. Do you know the meaning of your name? Which one? Ilo Abuchi. Um, Ilo Abuchi means my enemies are not my god. Hmm. Have you made any friends since you've been here at Cowboypedia? Yes. Who, who are they? Uh, there are many. Um, Victor, Emmanuel, um, Muhammad, Hashimu. There are many. That's a long list. No girls? Uh, one girl, Sharon. Hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause to Ilo Abuchi. Our second contestant. My name is Abdigani Alami from Frederick Gomez College, Obama, Shoyo State. Al Amin, are you in the military school? No. You're very poised, very serious, very, well, are you a class prefect, school prefect? No. You're not in charge of anything? No. Do you have a relative or yours that came here? Yes. Who is it? Abdigani Absamad. Who is he to you, your brother? Yes. Your elder brother? Yes. Okay. And uh, did you watch him on Cowboypedia? Yes. And how did you feel when, I know he didn't make it all the way, right? Yes. But what, what did he advise you coming to Cowboypedia this season? He said I should make sure I should be fast and have accuracy. You should be fast and have accuracy. The fastness, you have that on lockdown. You talk very fast. I hope you calculate as fast as well. Well done, Al Amin. Welcome to Cowboypedia. Our next contestant. My name is Alabi Oluwa Funke from Scholars Universal Secondary School, Ota. Welcome, Oluwa Funke. It seems your school is very good in maths as well. What did you score in the maths exam? 99. What happened to the one mark? Not sir. I know you gave it to them. Well done. You've done very well getting this far. I wish you all the best. A round of applause for Oluwa Funke. Our next contestant. My name is Aiba Tari Baba from Belarus Schools, Bayosa State. Aiba Tari, 
You know I'm going to ask you what your name means, right? Yes. What does your name mean? It means God, God's love. Fantastic. So who would you say loves you the most in your family? Well, I can't really say. I'll say my, my everybody. Ah, good well. answer. Because <laughs> if you say mommy, then daddy will be here. If you say daddy, mommy will be here. Are you the best in maths in your family? No. Ah, who's better than you? My brother. Well, um, I'm sure he wishes you all the best. Yes, well sir. done, okay? Yes, sir. Glad to have you on board. A round of applause to Ayi Batai. <laughs> Next contestant. My name is Duke Mana Favor from Deeper Life High School, Pavio, Cross River State. Favor from Cross River State, glad to have you here. How are you feeling? Fine. Fine, okay. Are there any other things you do at home when you're not solving math questions? Yes. What? What are the other things? Play games. What kind of games? Computer games. Computer. Why are you looking at me like, ah, you can go outside and play as well. So what's your favorite game? I don't have. You don't have. Not to worry, this is one game that is a bit different. And I wish you all the best, Favor, from Cross River. A round of applause to Favor, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> and our final contestant in the junior category. My name is Ekoko Juliet from the Ambassador's College, Ota. Juliet from the Ambassador's College, Ota. Do you have any other colleague here in the competition? Yeah, plenty. Who is he or she? Oh, senior or junior. Senior. Oh, how many are you? We are eight. Eight from one school. Mm -hmm. If I'm, in, if I'm, well, I think I'm correct, but that would be one of the highest numbers. What did you score in the exam? Ninety-eight. Ninety-eight. Your other colleagues, what did they score? Hundred ninety-nine, ninety-eight. All right, Juliet from Ambassadors, well done. Welcome to Cowbellpedia. A round of applause to our contestants. <laughs> this is the prelims, the seventh to be precise. This is round one of the junior category. We have two rounds to go through to determine which two of these six will move on to the semi-final. Round one is multiple choice questions where you're gonna be asked and the best out of round one the three best students out of round one will move on to round two. At the end of round two, which is our Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame, you are going to be given 60 seconds to give as many correct answers as possible. The students with the highest scores from round one and round two will move on to the semi-final. And I'm just looking for two of those. These are the rules. Do you understand them? Yes, yes Master. Master. I wish you all the best. Let's play round one. Round one starts now, what is the value of 3a plus 2b plus 10 when a is 4 and b is 5? a, 30, b, 32, 31, and d, 33. The correct answer is b, 32, and you're all off to a great start. You all have five points each. Well done. Moving on to question number two. The expression ax plus b is called dash equation, cubic, linear, parabolic, or quadratic. The correct answer is B, linear. I would love to say everybody got that, but we had one incorrect answer from Al Amin. Not to worry, we still have a couple more questions to go, 10 to be precise. Moving on to question number three. Factorize x raised to the power two minus nine, a, x plus three, x plus three, x minus x minus three, x minus three, x minus three, x plus three, and minus x plus three, x minus three. Correct answer is C, you all got it right. Well done. <laughs> Move on to question number four. Solve the equation 4C minus 12 is equals to C. A, three, B, two, one, or D, four. The correct answer is D, four. Well done to everyone except Aye, Batari, but not to worry. Let's move on to question number five. Like I always say, and I've seen this happen, it's not how you start, but how you finish. Question five, simplify three X plus nine X divided by three. A, five X, seven X, six X, or eight X. The correct answer is C, six X. Well done. 
Moving on to number six, we're halfway through round one. The linear inequality minus y is greater than six over seven can be written as a minus y is less than six over seven, y is less than minus six over seven, y is greater than minus six over seven, or y is greater than six over seven. The correct answer is b, y is less than minus six over seven, well done to each and every one of you. The first six rounds were very good. Well done. Well done. <laughs> Juliet, how do you feel after this round? I'm still scared. You're still scared. Well, calm down. What, what do you do to calm yourself down when you're scared? Oh, I watch movies. OK, should I play a movie for you? No, thank you. We'll do that after? Yes. OK. Hello, Buchi. Are you calculating something? No. There's no question. Um, I take a deep breath and I um, tell myself that there's nothing to be afraid of. Very well. There is absolutely nothing to be afraid of. What is at stake is the ultimate bragging rights and that crown. And for you at home, all you need to do is visit www.cabopedia.ng and start practicing. And you can also download the Cabopedia app from your Google Play Store on all Android devices. I'll be back after the break to take the next six questions in round one and find out which three contestants will move on to round two. Stick around. Instantly dissolving cowbell milk is both delicious and nutritious. It promotes good health and vitality. Cowbell milk has a blend of the important vitamins which we call Vita Rich. A, C, D, E and K plus vitamin B9, which helps with brain development. We've also got a deliciously creamy new formula that dissolves instantly. Cowbell, now deliciously creamy. Okay. Welcome back. It is round one. The seventh prelim, junior category, we have gone down with six questions and we have six more questions to go. The points, very, very tight. Each participant is give or take five points away from each other. So the next six questions will determine who stays and who moves on to the semi-final. Take a deep breath. Well done. You've all done so well so far. Question number seven. Ada bought 60 necklaces and put six necklaces in each packet. How many packets did she use? A, five, B, six, 12, or D, 10? The correct answer is D, 10. Well done. Let's move on to question number eight. The product of two numbers is 196. If one of the numbers is 14, find the other. A, 14, 13, 16, or D, 19. The correct answer is A, 14. You all got it as well. Now, if you get this next one, all of you, I'll personally give you a round of applause. Let's move on to question number nine. Find the reciprocal of 0 0.25. A minus 25, B one over four, C four, and D 25. <laughs> the correct answer is C four. Well done. Question number 10. Find the positive difference between 244 and 122. A, 121, B, 222, 122, and D, 244. Correct answer is C, 122. I'm not clapping again, but you all got it right. Well done, well done. I smell a tie break, but let's see what the two questions will do. Question number 11. A vehicle moving at a constant speed of 100 kilometers per hour, how long will it take to cover a distance of 50 kilometers? A, half an hour, four hours, two hours, or D, one quarter of an hour? The correct answer is A, half an hour. And you all got it right as well. I think my questions are too easy, right? Should I make them a bit harder? No? Juliet, what about you? 
It's okay the way it is. You don't know. Whichever which way you're going to answer. Let's move on to question 12. You've all done exceptionally well. This is the last question. It decrease 4,000 by 20%. A, 3,200, 3,880, 3,800, and D, 3,600. Now, you guys are just showing off. Well done. Correct answer is A, 3,200. Four of you are on the same number of points and two are five points less tied. But let's see who will move on and who will stay back. Wow. Collins, Uluafunke, Favor, and Juliet, you're all on 60 points. Ai Batari on 55 and Al Amin on 55. Unfortunately, the journey ends for our two contestants who are on 55 points. Ai Batari and Al Amin, thank you very much for getting this far. We are very proud of you. You are just five points away. But not to worry, the future is still very bright and we do believe you have the potential to be the next inventor. A round of applause to Ai Batari and Al Amin. We have a tie break with four of you. Only three of you are going to move on to round two. You've done so far till now. We're looking for the three students with the most correct answers and the quickest average time. I wish you all the best. Are you ready for your tie break questions? Yes, yes please, master. master. Question number one. Find the number which, when 15 is added to it twice, gives 47. A, 15, B, 17, C, 13, and D, 19. The correct answer is B17. Well done, Oluwa Funke. You're the only correct answer. Question number two. Janet has X Naira in her account. She spends Y Naira to buy books. How much does she have left in her account? X minus Y Naira, X plus Y, XY, or Y minus X Naira? Everyone bounce back in this one. Correct answer is A, X minus Y. Moving on to question number three. Well done to all of you. Solve for x if 2x plus 5 is less than 5 bracket x minus 2. A, x is greater than 5, x is less than 5, x is less than minus 5, or D, x is greater than minus 5. Correct answer is A, x is greater than 5. We had one correct answer from Juliet. Let's find out who had the quickest average time. Unfortunately, at this junction, We have to say bye-bye to Favor Duke Umana. You did very well, Favor. One of the fastest times. Well, you only had one point, but not to worry. We wish you all the best in your future endeavors, and thank you for making it this far on Carbopedia. We might see you in the senior category as well, so it's not over yet. A round of applause to Favor, ladies and gentlemen. Juliet, Olua Funke, Ilobaji, well done to all three of you. We're moving on to round two, which is the Cowboy PDF 60 Seconds of Fame. Here, it's more of speed and accuracy that matters. Just give you a quick recap of your response times. Collins, Ilobaji, you have an average of 0.58 seconds. Olua Funke, 0.99 seconds. And Juliet, 1.01 seconds. So you need to work on your response time. Numbers and numeration seems to be the strength of all three of you. I wish you all the best for round two. Are you all ready for your 60 seconds of fame? Yes, yes master. master. Juliet, I wish you all the best. Your Cowboypedia 60 seconds of fame starts now. Simplify minus 4K times minus Change 6. 4K squared. Correct. Solve the equation 2C over 3 divided is 4 Correct. Simplify 15A plus 5B. 8A plus 7B. Correct. What is the value of AB minus 2B if A is 1 and B is 1? Minus 1. Correct. Simplify. 12K plus 8. Correct. Simplify 5Z plus 1Z plus 1 divided by 5Z plus minus 1. Minus 1. Incorrect. If minus, minus 1. Minus 2. Incorrect. Simplify 7FG plus 2GF. 9FG. Correct. Simplify 1 over 3Y minus 1 over 7Y. 4Y over 21. Correct. Incorrect. Simplify 1 over 2Y. 
Correct. Simplify 24x. Flavors. Correct. Reduce 3 over 4x minus 1 over 3x. Find z if 2z is equal to 0. 0.25. Correct. Simplify 8y plus 5y. 13y. Correct. Find the value of minus x plus y minus z if x is 8, y is 9. Minus 2. Correct. If 3y over 4 is 6, what is y? 8. Correct. Simplify. 9p. Correct. Find the value of s when x is 2. Skip. Well done, Juliet. So you dab your, 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 your face there. Take a deep breath. Let's see if your performance will take you to the semi-final. Ulua Funke, you are also on 60 points with Juliet and Ilua Buchi. The next set of questions matter a lot. I wish you all the best. Are you ready for your Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame? Yes, Chris Master. Your Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame starts now. If A plus B is 4, what is 2A plus 2B? 8. Correct. Simplify 8k minus 2j plus 2k plus j. 10k minus j. Correct. Find the value of 6a plus 2b minus 3a plus 4b minus 3 when a is 3 and b is 2. 8. Incorrect. Expand z plus 2 by times q. qz plus 2q. Correct. Simplify 15y divided 5y. by 3. Correct. Factorize the expression lm plus... m open bracket l plus is m. Correct. Expand 2k bracket a plus 2 1. 2ak plus 2k. Correct. Simplify 14r minus 7r minus 5r cubed. 7r minus 5r cubed. Correct. Find the coefficient of x in the expression x squared minus, minus 6. 6. Correct. Simplify y raised to the power 3 plus z minus 4y cubed plus 4z. 5y cubed plus... Mm, minus 3y cubed plus 5 Z. Correct. Simplify minus, minus 3R plus 8Q. Correct. Define the product of P minus 3P plus P 3. P squared minus 9. Correct. <laughs> well done, Uwa Funke. Collins, your Cowboypedia 60 seconds of fame starts now. Find the square root of 8,100. Correct. Convert 0 0.00496. 0 0.004, 0 0.005. Correct. Express 24 as a product of its factors. Skip. Express the square of 0 0.3 in standard form. 9 times 10 to the power negative 1. Incorrect. It converts 267.94. Correct. Find one fourth of the positive difference of 24 and 8. Skip. How many years make up 36 months? Two years. Correct. Take away 20 from the square root of 289. 9. 9. Incorrect. Find the square root of the positive difference of 15 and 40. Skip. Add up 7 raised to the power 2 and 20. 69. Correct. What is 20% of 450? 4.5. Incorrect. Find the sum of the prime factors of 12. Skip. What is the place value of 6 in 3,000? Correct. Find the difference between 45 and the Zero. Problem. Correct. How much was shared Dinner. by... Come again. Trina. Incorrect. <laughs> 125 points, 115 points, and 95 points. Our semi finalists, congratulations to you. Collins, congratulations to you as well. Unfortunately, your journey ends here on Cowboypedia. You scored 95 points. Well done. Very proud of you and we wish you all the best. You did very well. A round of applause. <laughs> Juliet, I heard that sigh. Do it again. <sighs> yes, it's a sigh of relief. You did very well. Very, very well. 125 points. It's quite a high score. Olua Funke, well done to you as well. Our top females are in the semi-final. You've done your school, your parents very proud. And just like our contestants, I advise you as well to keep practicing. Download the Cowboypedia app on all your mobile, all your Android mobile devices from your Google Play Store and get practicing because practice makes perfection. We'll be back after the break to meet our six senior contestants, two spots available in the semi-final, who will be joining Juliet and Ulua Funke on Cowboypedia. Stick around to find out. The new Cowbell Choco formula has been stolen. Get it back at all costs.
tasting new Carvel Choco gives you the get up and go to be at the top of your game. Now with Vitorich Plus Iron. New great tasting Carvel Choco, a creamy chocolatey drink that helps give energy to get up and go. Welcome back to the number one mathematics quiz competition for secondary school students in Nigeria and Africa. It's Cowbellpedia. Two junior contestants have made it to the semi-final. Congratulations to Olua Funke and Juliet. We need two more from the senior category and they're on standby to let you know what they are all about. To those of you at home, if you're interested in being part of the Cowbellpedia show, I'm talking about the students, get your teacher or your principal to register your school. Tell them to visit www.cabopedia.ng. We had over 9,000 schools apply this season, and we expect a lot more next season. So you get on that train as well. Your school is entitled to 10 candidates, five in the junior and five in the senior category to represent the school. And if you do scale through and pass the exams, you'll be one of the lucky 108 who will be here in the studio with me. I have six of the 54 in the senior category who have made it this far. Let's get to know who they are and what they're all about. I'm Okia Dichamaka from the Ambassador's College of Top. Ihedi, how are you? Fine. Glad to have you on Carbopedia. Yes. Do you know anyone that has been on Carbopedia before from last year? Yeah. Uh, who is that? Obina. Obina. How far did he go? Semi-finals. Semi-finals. Your school? Are you and Obina close? Kind of. Kind of. Well, you, you got closer after the Carbopedia or before? Um, I don't know. Around that time. Around that time. Yeah. Did he give you any advice on how to perform when you get here? What yeah. did he say? I should not look at the time, <laughs> but I should just keep working. You should not look at the time? Yeah. Well, when it comes to 60 seconds of fame, you need to look yeah, at the time. I, know. I wish you all the best, Heidi. A round of applause to her, please. <laughs> Our second contestant. Adedikwe Timothy from Shepherd International College, Adoikiti, Ekiti State. Timothy, great to have you on Cowbellpedia. How do you feel being here on the stage right now? Is this a dream come true? Yes, I'm happy. I know so nervous. Do you remember taking your form to fill for the exam, the one you wrote that Neko conducted? I remember. Okay, how, what, what was going through your mind? I was imagining if I will ever be able to qualify. Seven. And when you heard the news that you qualified, who did you tell? Who was the first person you told? I told my classmates. Okay. Well, how did they celebrate with you? They were happy. But if you win the cash prize, will you share it with them? I don't think so. <laughs> I didn't think so either. Timothy, welcome to Cabalpedia. Round of applause to Timothy. <laughs> Our next contestant. I'm Auntie Simeon from Joint International College, Kaduna. Auntie, great to have you on board. Thank you. Who's your best friend? I'm close to a lot of people. A lot of people. Okay, I'm guessing in your school. So who's the closest person you have in your school? Musa Aruna. Musa. Is he good in maths as well? Not very. So you teach him maths from time to time? Yes. Okay, what, what's Musa's best subject? Chemistry. Are you as good in chemistry? Yes. You're better than Musa? No. Okay, I guess it's a good friendship. I wish you all the best, Ante, and welcome to Cowbellpedia. Thank you. A round of applause to Ante. <laughs> and our next contestant? Adel Jasuna from Otatutulu Academy, Ota. Okay, Hassana, great to have you on Cowbellpedia. Thanks. I've noticed that some of our contestants who don't really speak up do very well when it comes to mathematics, and they move on to the next round. Do you think you're one of those contestants? Yes. You think you're good enough? Yes. To be there, everyone here? Yes. I wish you all the best, Hassana. Welcome to Cabo Peter. Round of applause to her, please. <laughs> and our next contestant? Um, Iku Olamide from Greater Asmore International College, Arigiri Akoko, in those states. Great to have you, Olamide, on Cabo Pedia. Are you here alone? No. Okay, who did you come with? My teacher, uh, my mate. Okay, what's your mate's name? Maiwa. Maiwa. In which category? Senior. Senior as well. I wish you both all the best. Your math teacher, how long has he been your teacher? For five years now. Five? If he was here with you, what do you think he would be telling you? If he was standing beside you, what do you think he would tell you for the competition? 
comes with confidence. Well, I wish you all the best and all the confidence in the world. Welcome, Olamide. A round of applause for Olamide. And our final contestant in the senior category. I am Amo Victor from the College of the Immaculate Conception, Enugu. Great to have you on board, Victor. This is the first time your school is on Carbopedia. Yes. Okay, that's interesting. So, how is mathematics in your school? Is it everybody that is good in maths or just a select few? Not everybody, but the majority is good in maths. Majority. And out of that majority, you made it. Well done. What did you score in your exam? Uh, scored 100. Oh, yeah, one of the nine that scored 100. Yes. Well done. So what else do you do, minus scoring 100 over 100 in maths? I try to be a vast person, so I read vast. I read many other subjects, not just maths. Not just maths. What's your favorite subject apart from maths? Physics. Physics. OK, it's kind of like maths. I wish you all the best, Victor, and I wish you 100 over 100 in this competition as well. Thank well you. done. Welcome to Cabopedia. A round of applause Thanks. to Victor. There we have our six contestants in the senior category. Two spots available in the semi-final. This is the seventh prelim. I wish them all the best. Two rounds. Round one, series of objective questions, 12 to be precise. At the end of round one, the best three students with the highest scores move on to round two, which is our Carbopedia 60 Seconds of Fame. 60 seconds to give as many correct answers as possible in 60 seconds. At the end of round one and round two, the two students with the highest scores combined will move on to the semi-final. And judging by this lineup, it's going to be quite an interesting next couple of minutes. I wish you all the best. Well done for getting this far. Irrespective of what happens, you are true winners, you are true inventors, and we're all very proud of you. Round one, are you ready? Yes, Mr. Master. Your round one starts now. What is or are the signs of a negative number raised to an even power? A, both negative and positive, positive, either negative or positive, or D, negative. The correct answer is B, positive. We had four correct, two incorrect. Chiamaka and Olamide, not to worry, we have 11 more questions to go. You can still catch up. Evaluate, minus 2.3 divided by 100, minus 0 0.23, 0 0.023, 0 0.23, and minus 0 0.023. The correct answer is D, minus 0 0.023, and I'm glad to say every one of you got that right. Well done. Question number three. Tony writes 1,800 words in one hour. His rate of writing per minute is 1 over 30, 30, 15, and 45. The correct answer is B, 30 words per minute. Well done to each and every one of you except Timothy. But not to worry. Let's move on to question number four. Let's encourage him with a round of applause, guys. Well done. Question number four. A collection of well-defined objects or elements is called a union. B, series, C, sequence, D, set. The correct answer is D, set. Well done to all of you. Moving on to question number five. The temperature of an oven rose from 25 degrees Celsius to 210 degrees Celsius. What is the change in temperature? A, 185, 235, 210, or 75 degrees Celsius. Correct answer is A, 185 degrees Celsius. Moving on to question six. Well done to all of you, you got that one right as well. Which of the following is the biggest? Four over five, two over five, one over two, or D, three over five? Hey, Heidi, do you think you got the answer right? How sure are you? Over 100. 100. What about you, Auntie? 100. Hmm, Victor, you're looking doubtful. I'm sure. You're absolutely sure. Well done to each and every one of you. You got that right. A, 4 over 5 is the correct answer. We'll be back after the break. Make sure you download the Cowbellpedia app from the Google Play Store on all Android devices and get practicing. Our scoreboards have been shifting. We have some new top scorers. Make sure you're there so you can join me here in the studio. 
We'll be back to take the, name, the remaining six questions in round one in the senior category and find out which two contestants will be moving on to the semi-final. It's 2016 Cowbellpedia. Stick around. Instantly dissolving cowbell milk is both delicious and nutritious. It promotes good health and vitality. Cowbell milk has a blend of the important vitamins which we call Vita-Rich. A, C, D, E and K. Plus vitamin B9, which helps with brain development. We've also got a deliciously creamy new formula that dissolves instantly. Cowbell, now deliciously creamy. Welcome back. We have six more questions to go. It's a very close call. And like always, the last six questions always determines who starts and who finishes, who stays and who goes. But it's not how you start that matters, it's how you finish. You've all done so well, I wish you all the best. Question number seven. If x is four, y is minus three, evaluate x squared minus y and x plus y squared. A, 19 over 13, 49, 13 over 19, and D, minus 19 over 13. The correct answer is A, 19 over 13. We had four correct answers. Victor, you need to make sure you key in your answer in time. You only have five seconds. Let the computer know that you know the answer. Question number eight. Find the quadratic equation whose roots are minus three and minus three. A, x squared plus six x minus nine, x squared plus six x plus nine, x squared minus nine, and x squared minus six x plus nine. The correct answer is B, x squared plus 6x plus 9. Well done to each and every one of you. <laughs> Question number 9. If the probability of events in a given sample space are 0.1 x and 0.5, what is the value of x? A, 0.2, B, 0.4, 0.5, and D, 0.6. The correct answer is B, 0 0.4. Well done to each and every one of you, except Timothy and Victor, who didn't key in the answer. Every point counts, Victor. Make sure you key in your answer as well. Moving on to question number 10. Subtract 9x plus 4y from 20x minus 4y. A, 11x, B, 11x minus 8y, 11x minus 4y, and D, 3x plus 8y. Eleven x minus eight y is the correct answer, which is option B. Well done to every one of you. Moving on to question eleven: Which of the following points satisfies the inequality x is less than minus three? A minus two, B minus one, C minus four, and D one. The correct answer is option C minus four. We only had one of you get it incorrect. Next question is very important to some of you. The tie break is inevitable if some of you move along this path. You need to break away from the pack. I wish you all the best with question 12. Which of the following is a closed statement? Two is a prime number. X is an even number. Salt and pepper. D, follow me. The correct answer is A. Two is a prime number. Well done, again, to all of you. Hassan, better luck next time. Hassana, are you okay? Well done, well done to each and every one of you. But let's find out who will be moving on to round two. Don't forget, I only need three of you with the highest scores. It was a very close call. And like I said, question 12 was very important. Olamide, Victor, and Timothy, well done to three of you. Unfortunately, your journey ends here on Cowbellpedia. You've done exceptionally well, and we wish you all the best. A round of applause to them, guys. Wow. The ladies are in charge. Ante, well done. 60 points. Ihedi, 
Well done to you as well. You're on 55 points. And uh, Hassana, you're on 55 points as well. We're moving on to round two. Speed is very key. Just a quick recap so you know how fast you are. Hassana, your average response time 1.77 seconds. Ante, yours is 1.03. And of course, Chiamaka is 0 0.79. You need to do a bit faster in this particular round. Let's move on to round two. After the break, we'll find out which two candidates will move on to the semi-final. It's still 2016 Cowbellpedia, the number one mathematics quiz competition for secondary school students in Nigeria and Africa. It's brought to you by Promasador, the makers of Cowbell Our Milk, and endorsed by Neko. I still have something for you out there. If you're watching, stick around and find out. Which of the following is a plane shape? A. Sphere B. Cylinder C. Cuboid and D. Circle Be part of the Cowbellpedia Best 11. Type SC space your name space location space your answer to 33121 for a chance to win fabulous prizes for the week. And if you're a student out there, make sure you download the Cowbellpedia app from your Google Play Store on all Android devices. You can start practicing now and have a shot at coming here next season. We really look forward to seeing you here on the stage. We had over 9,000 schools participate, over 47,000 students enter for the exam, but the best 108 made it here. 54 in the senior category. And out of that 54, we have three of them who've made it to round two. Well done to all three of you. Hey, hey D. How do you feel right about now? Good. Good? What would you give yourself over 10 on your performance? I don't know. What score do you think your teacher would give you watching right now? Six. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Very difficult teacher. Not what, really. What's your teacher's name? Mr. Bello. Mr. Bello. OK. And Mr. Bello has been with you how long? Maybe like. One and a half years. One and a half years. What, what did you score in the exam? 96. 96. Okay. Well, I think Mr. Bello should do better than 6 over 10. Ante, what about you? How do you feel right about now? Fine. Fine? Are you just saying that or you feel fine? Are you, you're not scared? You're not troubled? You're going to make it to the semi-final? Even like win the competition? I like that confidence. Well done. Well Thank done. You. Hasana. You have proved me right so far. I know you don't talk much, but at the end of the day, it's the numbers that count. But how do you feel? I'm excited. You're excited? Okay, I know you're, you're a lady with very few words, but well done. You've all done so far so good. This is round two, the Cowbellpedia, 60 seconds of fame. 60 seconds to give me as many correct answers as possible. I wish you all the best. So. Ante, are you ready for your 60 seconds? Yes, Quizmaster. Your Cowbellpedia 60 seconds of fame starts now. Find the range of values of x for which 1 plus 2 x is x greater than, than 1. Three. Come again? x greater than 1. Correct. Find if 3 and 4 are the roots of the quadratic equation ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to 0. Find x evaluate. squared minus 7x plus 12. Incorrect. Please speak up. Evaluate x plus y plus 3 minus x minus... Skip. Solve the equation 5y plus 6 is equal to 21. y equals to 3. Correct. Find the positive difference between coefficients of x and coefficient of x squared in 4x squared plus 3. 7x. Correct. A boy has m minus 3 mangoes and later receives another 4 from his friend. How many mangoes does he m have? m plus now? 1. Correct. Solve the inequality 4x plus 20 is greater than x 2. is greater than 5. Incorrect. Find the sum of the coefficient of x and constant in 2x squared plus 5x. 6. 5. Incorrect. If y is 2 plus x minus x squared, what is the value of y when x Skip. is minus 2? If p is 42, r is 3, find the value of p minus r squared over r. Skip. Find the gradient of the line y squared to 5x over 4 minus 2. 5 over 4. Correct. Well done. Well done, Ante. That was a good performance. I saw you squinting. Don't worry, just calm down. Let's see how it goes. Let's move on to our next contestant. Chiamaka, okay, Ihedi. I wish you all the best. Your Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame starts now. The 
The product of the additive inverse and multiplicative inverse of y is? Minus 1. Correct. Simplify x squared minus y squared x divided... x minus y. Correct. If 5x minus 12 is less than or equal to 3x, then what is the range of values of x? X is less than 6. Incorrect. Simplify p squared plus pk divided by p squared minus k squared. p over p minus k. Correct. Find the value of x for which 3x... Minus 3. Correct. Find the value of x for which the expression 9x... Plus or minus 2. Correct. Y is equal to 2x squared minus 5x plus 1. What is the value of y at two? x is 2? Minus 1. Correct. A student is 16. 16 plus x. Correct. Solve 7 divided... Skip. If the difference between two numbers is 9 and the smaller number is k, the bigger number is... 9 plus k. Correct. How many hours are in y minutes? y over 60. Correct. Make f the subject of the formula. Skip. One. What must be added to x squared minus 36. 12? Correct. Simplify Skip. x over... Solve for the values of x in the equation x minus 2 all squared equals to 9. x is 5. Incorrect. Well done. I'm the one asking the questions, but I'm the one sweating. Hasana, you're on 55 points. Same with Ihedi. And from experience, I know anything can happen. I wish you all the best. Are you ready for your Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame? Yes, Kusmaster. I wish you all the best. Your Cowboypedia 60 Seconds of Fame starts now. Express 0 0.0... 0 0.0387. Correct. Express 0 0.0... 6.2 times 10 to the minus 6. Correct. Solve 3 bracket... Skip. Eight. The place value of 7 in 807,350... Thousands. Correct. What is the logarithm of 10,000... Four. To Correct. A meeting started at 10.35 a.m. and... Skip. The number of eligible voters in a village is 6,946. Express its numbers to three significant figures. Six, 6,900. Come again? 6,900. Incorrect. Simplify 666 divided. Simplify 9 raised to the power 0 it's times 1. It's 1. Correct. Express 24.2. 2.42 3 times 10 to the power 1. Correct. What must be added to 0 0.01 to make it 0 0.1? 0 0.99. Incorrect. Approximate 0 0.09. 0 0.0. .0 0.10. In, I'll take your first answer. Incorrect. Express 6.73 times 10 to the minus 3. Correct. Simplify square root of 12 times square root of 3. All Plus 6. Correct. <laughs> Hasana, well done. 105 points, 95 points, and 85 points. Ihedi, you are on 105 points. Hasana, you are 95 points, which means, Simeon Ante, this is where the road stops for you on Cowboypedia. You've done very, very well. I wish you all the best. Good luck. A round of applause to Ante, please. It seems our seventh prelim is an all-female affair, both at the junior and senior levels. Well done to Hasana and Ihedi. You've done exceptionally well. You've secured your two spots in the semi-final. Now Hasana is smiling. The first smile I've seen today. Well done. Congratulations to both of you. The journey is still very tough ahead for our contestants. It's the seventh prelim. We have two more prelims to go. Three semi-finals and one final. In the words of Thomas Edison, there's a way to do it you better find it. And we are going to find you wherever you are. If you're a true inventor, we will find you. On behalf of the Cowboypedia team, thank you for tuning in. I am Oscar, your quiz master. Catch us same time, same station right here. Bye for now.